Whoa, yeah, swear to God I'm with it I don't see nobody in my lane It's quite go get it like me Whoa, please don't be wasting my time with that business Who are you kidding, man? Yeah, 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 yeah Alright you guys, how are we? Welcome back to another video. In today's video we're going to be looking at... Well, actually no, he can't be the top rated running back because Saquon Barkley's still yet to come. But we're looking at Ezekiel Elliott. Number 18 on the top 100 NFL's players of 2019. He's a running back, he plays for the Cowboys. He's, he's becoming a franchise player. And he's one of the most explosive, one of the most exciting, one of the most decorated running backs in the league currently. We're going to have a look at him. It's 3 minutes and 35 seconds long. That's what we like to see. Stick around and I'll see you in a minute. The quicker you're here, the faster you go. That's why where I come from, the only thing we know is... That's one of my nightmares, seeing him come through the, through the whole untouch and he, he got to the third level. And I got <laughs> like me got to tell him that he's probably 50 pounds bigger than him. Is he, is he that big? 54 last year. Um, his size, his, his thickness, his, 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 his weight was not something that really triggered in my mind as his biggest attribute, but maybe it is. Who was the toughest guy to tackle? Ezekiel Elliott. Wow, really? So it's not just his O line that's doing everything for him. Zeke is is one of those guys where he's just a special back. I'm loving this. That's consistent, man. You're ready to play the Dallas Cowboys, you better strap it up. Because if he's not running you over or jumping over you, he's catching the screen and catching the ball out of the backfield and taking it to the house. Dynamic player, man. Dynamic running back, and that is what you want. That's what you need in this league. Running backs need to be able to catch, for sure. Don't they? First time I've seen that guy. That's what excites us as defenders, man, because we know he's coming down, you know. He's going to make a 34, a 37. Fourth and inches, they're going to hand it to Elliott, coming right first down. That guy wants the contact, that guy wants to hit. He wants the contact, I mean that's the running, that's the kind of running back you want, right? You don't want a running back who shies away from contact, and I don't believe that any running back in the NFL is going to shy away from contact. It's, it's, you know, they're not going to get to that level with that attitude, are they? You need to want to initiate the contact. You need to want to run through that defender rather than d the defender wanting to run through you. We heard about a defender that liked to run through people. He said he likes to run through people. He used to like to run through people anyway. Now it's not so legal. His name was Rodney Harrison. And the first thing that I thought of when he said that is, okay, well let's, let's put the, the shoe on the other foot here for a second and imagine if you were actually a running back and you thought the same thing, that you wanted to run through your defenders, you know. Don't try and get around them, you want to run through them. That's the attitude. That's how you go into contact. That is a nightmare to try and tackle. Especially if you're expecting him to come full force into you and try and truck you over and he's got a hurdle in his back pocket that he can do at any time. I mean, good luck. Here's the top rated running back. 
he's cut walking to let you know that he's here and he's playing there. That's a great player too. Wow. Wow. Let you know that he's here and he's playing there. Damn, man. I don't think I've seen a receiver. Uh, I don't think I've seen a reception like that from a running back so far. Just a straight up receiver's route. You can line them up anywhere. God given. God given talents, eh? Well, 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 Ezekiel Elliott. Okay, with everyone talking about how big and strong he is, we're going to have to have a look. Wow, wee, he's 24. Six foot, well over 100 kgs, nearly 230 pounds. He went the fourth pick in the first round of the 2016 draft. He went to Ohio State. Really? How come I didn't know that? Did he go there the whole time? He was second in career rushing yards with 3,961. And yards per game with 101.6 in his whole entire college career. Second and third most rushing yards in a season and five of the top 20 rushing yards in a game. His 43 rushing touchdowns was fourth most all time and his 23 in 2015 was third most in a season. And there's a hell of a lot more there. Far out. I didn't know that. That's awesome. Maybe he's going to be one of my favorites now. <laughs> 447 for the 40. I actually looked at his combine highlights in a previous video when I tried to look at some running back drills to practice and he impressed the hell out of me. But I was wondering what his vertical jump was and it was 32 and a half inches. So, 40 games so far in the league, 868 attempts, 4,048 yards. Three seasons, he already got 4,000 yards. That's not bad. 4.7 yards per carry, 28 rushing touchdowns. He has over a thousand receiving yards in three seasons, six receiving touchdowns, and the list goes on. Wow. All right. Damn, he's had a pretty good career, hasn't he? And he's number 18 on the list. Last year he was 54. Not a bad increase. Not a bad increase at all. Okay, guys. Who the hell is going to be next? <laughs> That's the question. Got to be a big name. Philip Rivers. Oh, Rivers. I've actually got no idea who he is. And unfortunately, I don't have my LA Chargers uh, pajama pants to put on right now. It's just me, half a laptop, the TV screen, and you guys. So if you've liked this video, if you've liked the series, hit the like button. If you want to subscribe, please do. And I'll see you back here very shortly to check out Philip Rivers for the first time. How do you feel this? You gotta love a bit of Rivers. See you soon, guys.